At the University of Southern California, the news came as a shock. The associate head coach of the college basketball team is among those charged with fraud and corruption in the NCAA. It just came out of nowhere, you know, like, wow. Certainly anything that could impact the future of the team is concerning to me. Tony Bland is one of four coaches accused of accepting bribes in exchange for their influence, including Lamont Evans of Oklahoma State, Chuck Person at Auburn, and Emmanuel Richardson at the University of Arizona. They say money changed hands, but the betrayal ran deeper. All of them had the trust of the young players they coached and recruited. Young men who looked up to them and believed that the coaches had their best interest at heart. The feds say the coaches accepted thousands of dollars to steer players to certain managers or advisors. Anthony Bland described what he could do for the managers and advisors this way, quote, I can definitely mold the players and put them in the lap of you guys. Altogether, 10 people were charged, including an employee at the Adidas Sportswear Company. He's accused of funneling money to high school players in exchange for committing to colleges the company sponsors. The feds describe the defendants as coyotes circling their blue chip prospects and say the investigation is ongoing. Now this afternoon, all four of the universities mentioned placed their assistant coaches on suspension. The University of Arizona's Emmanuel Richardson has reportedly been relieved of all basketball duties. This may not be the end of it. The University of Louisville, which is already on probation by the NCAA, was notified that it is under investigation. So like I said, this could be the tip of the iceberg. Um, for years, we've heard of players being paid and mm. money being exchanged and things like that. But now this is the first time that it's really concrete. Wow, or at least coming to light. Coming to light. Chuck Person, by the way, former NBA star. Rookie of the year, made about $23 million during his career, and wow. now he's uh, allegedly taking bribes. So we'll wow. see. We'll see we how will. everything works we out. Will. Thank you, Otis.